Police say those other two suspects are minors and because of that, their names will not be released, but they say charges are forthcoming. And we know the postal keys of that mail carrier were stolen because keys give access to mailboxes, which means these can have access to uh, people's personal information, their packages. And this is something we're seeing happen happening more and more nationwide. I don't want to see my brother doing this, this kind of stuff. You know. The family of 18 year old Baraka Janvier leaving his arraignment after the judge denied him bail in his robbery case. He's accused of stealing the postal keys from a mailman, threatening him with a BB gun and giving those keys away for $500 in Lowell. I share the state's concerns about the severity of the offense and the travel here to New Hampshire to carry it out. Jean Vier admitting his guilt to police, but telling them the entire robbery was planned by another person. It's not like him. I know him well. He's my brother. He's always home in his room playing video games. News 9 caught up with the victim who was back at work one day after the robbery. Were you surprised when these guys came up behind you? Uh, yes, it was a surprise for yeah. sure. But it's a surprise mail carriers across the country are experiencing, with the U.S. Postal Inspection Service reporting 643 robberies last year, an increase of nearly 30 percent from 2022. While I'm sorting, sorting the mail, they snuck around and come up and uh, punch me as hard as I could in the side of the head with the goal of just knocking me out. We're seeing a big increase in carriers being robbed at gunpoint. And Nashua police say those uh, postal keys allegedly taken by Jean-Vierre have not been recovered yet.